course update. I'm at mile 7.40 and I'm at the part of this race where I can't trust the fart anymore. Buenos dias. Today is Tuesday, September 10th. Perfect time to go for a little run right now. I'm not really too sure how many miles I'm planning on doing, but we'll see. And let's just count the miles as we do it. All right, no better time like the present to get after it. And let's do it. All right, just hit lap one, 9.47. Pretty good pace for a, a long run. Don't know how far I'm gonna go kind of kind of situation today. Love it. It's so nice out. Ooh, that breeze. The breeze is cold, but it feels good. So I'm running the route right now that I call the, the red mailbox route, but instead I'm gonna mix it up a little bit. We're about to hit the trails and do some off-road and got the off-road shoes on today. Okay, we just hit mile two, 11.25, a little slower. There were some uh, uphill sections that I kind of had to walk. We're out in the trails now, so it's all good. We are trekking along. Haven't seen another person out here either, but I got this like, it's really weird feeling like I'm being watched, you know? Mile three, 10.44. So if we stay on this path, this is at least gonna be a six mile run. And I gotta do a 15K sometime this month. So if we're already at six miles, we might as well keep pushing to get the extra 3.3, right? That's not a terrible idea. I love a good long run. Nine to 10 miles are probably my favorite, just for like everyday kind of run. Mile four, another 1041. We're doing great. This part is like super steep. There's a lot of poison oak, so I kind of would just rather walk it instead of get poison oak, you know what I'm saying? So if we're doing nine, and we've only got five left. Here's some more of that, that fur I was talking about yesterday. Maybe it's coyote fur. And we also just broke five miles. If we push it to 10, we're halfway done. And we're almost at an hour. So a little bit slower than I like to go, but a nice 10 minute mile pace. So then in an hour, it would have put us at six miles. But hey, this is all good too. So I've been trying to be better about my uh, calorie intake out here. And I just hit an hour and I like these uh, energy gel chew things by Honey Stinger. This one's the fruit smoothie. The pomegranate ones are probably my favorite flavor so far, but they were all sold out at Walmart. Yeah, and that's another thing I like about it is you can find these at Walmart. You don't have to order them online and then wait for them to come. So yeah, it's time for a little snack break. Then we'll get back to running. Doing good out here. It's hot. It's uh, 1220 right now. So I guess this is lunch, right? <laughs> Just hit mile six. I was changing my song so I couldn't hear what my uh, split time was. Only four to go. We're doing great. Still on the trail too. Try to keep most of our miles on the trail. But running the street is just so freaking boring. Or is this bear poop? Or is that deer poop? I'm not really too sure. I need to pull up, I need to pull up a scat guide when I get home and do a comparison to see what that is. Lap seven, that was almost a 12 minute mile, which is okay, cause on that one I stopped for where I was walking to eat my snacks. There was a giant sand hill that I went up to. It's all good, we only got three to go. Lap eight, 1051. For some reason my, my headphones aren't reading out the mileage like they usually do. I kind of stopped here on lap six, lap five, lap six, and it's annoying. Hello. I don't know what it is, but fellow runners and just like people in general in the village, whenever they see me, they just get so confused, like like a deer in the headlights. They're not expecting to see me ever out here. Like it's like seeing Bigfoot. That lady definitely had it. She didn't even say hi. Just like, oh, Bigfoot, oh, just a friendly little lady, you know? It's not that big a deal.
Mile nine! That was a 12 minute mile. Can't remember actually what happened. I think we had some walking. Oh, I stopped to pull over for that lady to go by. One mile to go for 10. Stoked. It's been a fun 10 miles. Pretty easy too. It makes me happy. Only what? 25 days until race day. Just hit 10 miles. That was a 10 for 10.27. Here we are at the finish line. Woo! 10.05 miles. An hour and 55 minutes and 55 seconds. Not bad. Not bad if you're just going out and seeing, just going for a run and not really having any plan or any goal distance. Just want to go out for a run and have fun. Well, everyone, thanks for watching. Thanks for coming along with that, on that 10 mile run with me today. That was a great time. And yeah, uh, Eric texted me and he's like, hey, you up for 16 tomorrow? So it sounds like we're gonna go up to the Pismo Preserve and have a great time. And we'll see if, we'll see if I got 16 in me. So yeah, uh, again, thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, check out my merch store. And I will see y'all tomorrow. Later.